Hi everyone, I'm Megan, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome to my channel. I know it's been a while, I'm probably the worst YouTuber ever. Not even a YouTuber anymore, like I'm just the person who's just bad. I'm the worst person ever. <laughs> so yeah, anyway, the weekend before last, I went to Manchester and Liverpool and I spent loads of money. And I bought quite a lot of things, quite a lot of things. Too many, too many things. I've just bought a lot of things over the past few months and I've just kept them in the bags in the corner of my room because I know you guys love my haul videos and I was sort of planning on filming a haul video but when I wanted to I didn't really have a lot of things to show so I just sort of just left them and then over the few over like the weeks I was like just collecting loads and like the pile grew and now I just it's just the pile's a bit too big now and I just kind of want to put everything away so today I'm going to be filming a haul video and I feel like this intro is way too long um then it really needs to be so I'm going to start now and hopefully you guys will enjoy it make sure you like comment and subscribe if you haven't already and let's get into the video so the first place I'm going to start off with is Chanel and if you know me I love designer brands I just can't really get enough of them which is really unhealthy because they're really expensive but honestly my Chanel perfume that I got last Christmas or the Christmas before I think it was Christmas before last I got a Chanel perfume and it ran out and I was very very sad so I thought I'm going to invest in another one because I always get compliments on my Chanel perfume like I was in I was at work the other day and like I just sprayed like a little bit on my wrist just because like just a little bit like not a lot um and I had loads of compliments and I was like is it that strong like <laughs> I didn't really realise, because like when you spray something on you, you sort of just forget, and you don't really smell it anymore, um, but yeah, it was really good. So I ran out of that one, so I thought I'd buy a new one, and this is the Coco Chanel, I'm going to get it out of the box, it's, I don't think it's new, I can't, I can't remember if it's new or not, but yeah, this is it, I just got the little one, because um, the bigger ones were more expensive, I think this was £55 alone, and it's, it's tiny, um, the most expensive one was like £110, and I was like... I mean like, <laughs> I'm not that bad with spending. And it smells amazing, like I've used a bit of it when I went to Liverpool because I got this the day before I went and I just took it with me because I like having like a posh perfume to put on. Um, so I used that and it smells amazing, like it smells incredible. So yeah, that is the only thing I got from Chanel, but it's like, I love it, I'm obsessed. Okay, so moving on. <laughs> so the second place I went to is Selvages and I got three things, so all in the sale, which is amazing. So the first thing that I got is this Calvin Klein bralette thing and I'm absolutely obsessed with it, like absolutely. I, I love it so much and it's so comfortable. This is about 20 pounds, I believe, I'm not really sure. So yeah, got this and it's really, really nice. Really, really like basic gray Calvin bralette thing. I, I'm obsessed. And then the next thing I got was this card holder. Um, I've always wanted a card holder, don't ask me why, like, <laughs> I'm not the sort of person who carries cash with me, like, I don't really like the weight of coins, so I thought this would come in handy, um, for, like, on a night out, that I don't even take, like, my purse with me, or anything, I just take this, and it's, like, all, it all stays together, so, yeah, it's just really handy, I think this was, like, £17, and it's from Kurt Geiger, so, very good, very nice, I'm very happy with that, so, the last thing that I got, um, are from Adidas and these are some shoes. Um, I really wanted some new trainers. Like the last trainers I got are from Nike and they're getting a bit like worn now if you get me. So I kind of just wanted some new trainers. These were in the sale from like £80 to like 47 So I was like, well, I'm gonna have to, like that's really good. So these are just some gazelles, just some gazelles. They're suede and they're sort of like in this sort of brownish Color. I'm not really sure like how I would describe it, but I'm obsessed with like £47 and I was like incredible. So the next place I went to was Urban Outfitters, but I don't have the bag for it because it's split. Um I got two things from Urban, and the first thing was a Cabin Pine bralette. Oh, and it's just like this black one. I'm obsessed with it, like literally obsessed. Like it's so nice. I don't know if you've seen it in one of my pictures. Um I posted a picture of me like in a crop top, but then this was underneath it so you could see the straps. And I'm just obsessed. I'm obsessed. I can't remember how much this was. So the next thing that I got is this cropped sweater type thing. Um, it's not that thick, but like it is thick enough to be a sweater, if you get me. I wrote last night to Nando's with my boyfriend and he loved it. I love it. It's great. It's a really nice top. Um, and it's quite warm as well. Like it's long sleeves, so it's nice. And I think this was about £30, £35. I'm not 100% sure. The next place I went to was Superdrug. And what I got from Superdrug was pretty basic, I think. Um, I just got some fake tan. Um, this was recommended to me 
from someone I work with and her tan is always amazing so I'm always like what do you use and she uses this and I sort of decided to get it I got it in dark because I didn't have any medium so I feel like it's gonna be too dark for me but you know what I'll give it a go and then I got a tanning mitt thing and then I got an eyeliner this is like my all-time favorite eyeliner it's from Rimmel London and it's called Glam Eyes Professional Liquid Liner so it's what I use on like a daily basis. The next place I went to was Urban Decay. They had a store in Liverpool, so I thought it'd be rude not to go in. Um, I've got one thing that I bought from there and then another thing that they sent me kindly, which I was blown away by. But okay, so I'm gonna start with the thing that I bought at the store. So this is the Urban Decay Naked Highlighter Palette. It's really cool. Like as soon as I saw it on the shelf, I was like, I need it. Uh, let me open it. Yeah, this is the palette and it just opens and there's like three highlights in there and oh, I'm obsessed, I'm obsessed and I really can't wait to try it out. And then when I got home from Liverpool, I received this in the post and I was very, very happy with it. Very, very happy. Like I wanted to get it in Liverpool, but they didn't have it in the store. It's a very good job that I didn't end up buying it anyway because I would have had two. Sort of like reddish tones and like purpley, like I just love it. Like I'm obsessed, like these are my colors. These are like my colors. <laughs> I'm absolutely obsessed with that palette and I really can't wait to use it. Like. The colours are so pretty. Okay, so the next place I went to was Topshop. And Topshop, I've been obsessed with. Like, this time last year, I hadn't bought anything from Topshop ever. And now, everything that I own is basically from Topshop. So the first thing that I got from Topshop is this top. And it's an Adidas top. I've been, like, obsessed with Adidas lately and Nike and, like, Calvin Klein. It's quite ridiculous. This is the first top, and it was £25 from Topshop. And it's just this Adidas top, and I'm obsessed. Like, it's just easy just to throw on. Like, it's just a top you can wear whenever really and then the next thing that i got were a pair of shorts not gonna lie love island inspired this purchase just because i saw camilla wear them and i was low-key like i want to be like camilla so i bought the shorts <laughs> i can't really remember how much these were actually they've got a price tag i'm such an idiot these are 10 pounds so winner winner chicken dinner great so got those shorts so the last thing that i bought is just a basic black tee that says cute but psycho on it um I bought this in Liverpool with my boyfriend and he was like, oh my god, that's so you. And I was like, do I take offence to that or what? Like, do I, is that a good thing that you're calling me psycho but cute but what? This is just a basic top. I worked to Nando's the other day, no joke. And this was, I think, £20. So yeah, cute little purchases from Topshop. Can't really go wrong with them, just like lazy, comfy, everyday clothes which I needed. <laughs> and then I went to Victoria's Secret. I haven't bought any underwear from Victoria's Secret in so, so long. But then when I went to the store in Liverpool, like <laughs> I went a bit crazy, no joke. So the first thing that I got was this spray and it was called Tease. <sighs> I haven't bought a Victoria's Secret spray for so long because I bought so many like last year and they're not all run out yet. <laughs> and I was kind of waiting for them to run out, but this just smells too good. So I just couldn't pass up the opportunity to buy it. And then I went a bit crazy on the underwear. Like I wasn't, I was debating whether to show you guys the underwear, but like, I just thought, you know what, fuck it, it's fine. So yeah, I got the five for 25 and then I got one pair, which was in the sale for like three pounds. So I was like, might as well. So the first pair, which I got are just like these basic Victoria's Secret pants. Like these kind of remind me of the Calvin Klein pants. And then I also got the gray ones of these. Um, but they're in the wash, so not gonna show you them. So the next pair which I got are just black ones that say Victoria's Secret on the top. And these are also like comfy underwear, which I could just wear whenever. And then the next three pairs are like sexy underwear. So yeah, the uh, the first pair, like these. I'm literally just gonna show you them because like we're all girls here, most of us girls. Hi, if you're a guy. <laughs> and then the next pair are like this plum color. And then I got some black ones as well. That's everything I got from Victoria's Secret. And then I went shopping because I had a job interview um, and I literally don't have anything for a job interview. So I went shopping, bought a whole outfit and then canceled the job interview, so. <laughs> Logic, Becky. Um, I went to outfit for shoes and I'm just gonna show you the shoes quickly. These are from Dodge Perkins and they're just like loafers. Like just plain, <laughs> nearly hit myself in the face. They're just plain loafers. Like easy, sort of 15 pound, throw on loafers, they're great. And then for like the main, main outfit, I went to H&M and it all came to like 37 pound or like 47, I can't remember how much, but it was really good. Like I remember being like, is that it? Like that's really, really good. So the first thing that I got is a blazer, um, like a cute cropped top. 
tight blazer like it's really nice like i could wear it whenever like i feel like a teacher when i'm wearing this like no joke i feel like a female boss it's great so next thing that i got is just this black plain top with a bit of lace at the top just like easy you know just an easy top to wear <laughs> and then the last thing which i got um were these trousers just like just normal work trousers really um so yeah like that whole outfit looks so nice again i was like cute so i got all that and it came to like how much did it actually come to now it literally came to 37 pound no it literally came to 37 pound i'm shook so the last place i went to was michael kors and if you know me i'm obsessed with michael kors like i got two things and the first thing that i got was a purse and this was in the sale which I feel it's a good enough justification for buying a Michael Kors purse is because it was in the sale. This was reduced from 140 to 67. So I was like, I kind of need to. And plus it's like the perfect color, it's like my color. Like, is that any more me? Like, didn't think so. I currently like filled it. So I'm not gonna show you inside it because it's like a purse and it's like got a bank card and everything in it. But yeah, this is the first thing and I'm obsessed. And then the bag which I got, um, it's different to the bag that I've already gotten from Michael Kors and it's like this, I don't know, like it's really nice. So like when I saw it, it reminded me of the Chanel bag, you know, like the Chanel bag that people have and like the short straps. So yeah, this is the bag which I've got and I'm literally like, I use it all the time now. Like I use it more than my other Michael Kors bag, which is like a bit ridiculous because that was more expensive. So this was in the designer outlet in New York and it was like, it was discounted, but like not a lot. Like I think I got like a hundred pound off it but it was reduced from like 300, so it was still quite expensive. You can have it like that, so you have like short straps and then you can have it like longer like that. Um, so you can just like wear it on the shoulder. So yeah, that is everything which I've bought within like the last few months. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I will do another video very soon explaining everything that's been going on, on in my life because I feel like I've been slacking on YouTube and I feel like I've been disconnected from you guys for quite a while and you know what you guys have been there for me in the past and i feel like i need to do another video very soon explaining everything that's been happening because a lot has been happening and a lot has been on my mind so i feel like it'd be nice to edit all out with you guys and like we can talk so yeah hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure you like comment and subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you guys next time on the video on my channel so yeah <laughs> bye everyone Shorty you down, good lord Baby got them open all over town Who strictly bitch, you don't play around Cover much ground, got game by the pound Getting paid is a forte Each and every day, true play away